A long flight from pretty much anywhere in the world, Manaus looms up in the heart of the Amazon, a concrete jungle with two million residents. We've just uh, come down to the Rio Negro. This is a tributary of the Amazon River, not even the real thing. And you can see how big it is. The other side, you, you definitely need a boat to get over there. Uh, this is the beach in Manaus. Let's go check it out. A pickup soccer game, and in the middle, a star-spangled bandana. A group of recent grads from Cornell playing with local talent. We can walk around with these, everybody wants to come yeah. in. We probably had a hundred people come up to us and take pictures with us. Yeah. We're kind of like celebrities whenever we wear our American stuff. We find more bandanas at the port. This is the closest thing to a bus station they've got here, so fans wanting to get to know the Amazon, this is where they start. Uh, we're going on a tour in the Amazon. We're going to see the waters meet and uh, see some anacondas, hopefully. And at night... They've set up screens and strategic points across the city. This one's in the heart of the historic center. It's right in the shadow of the Opera House. And this is where people come together to watch the games. More Team USA fans turn up here, optimistic about Sunday's match against Portugal. 2-1. 2-1 again. 2-1. But a group of Portuguese supporters just a few steps away says they're keeping their faith in Cristiano Ronaldo. Shasta Darlington, CNN, Manaus, Brazil.